Hey everybody, welcome back to 365 Riffs for Beginning Guitar. Today we have Fun, Fun, Fun by the Beach Boys. Now don't forget to check out the playlist I have at my YouTube channel that will show you all the riffs I've done since January 1st, 2017. Hundreds and hundreds of great riffs and songs. So, uh, Fun, Fun, Fun features great classic rock and roll rhythm guitar. Sounds a little like this. part for fun 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 is just classic rock and roll of course we all know the song starts off with a great chuck berry style introduction we're not going to focus on that right now we're going to focus on what happens during the verse and the chorus now before we get started to play along with the original tune you'll have to retune your guitar strings down a half step i have not done that here but if you're interested a new tuning would go e flat a flat d flat g flat b flat e flat and that's from the fat string down to the skinny string, everything down a half step. No need to retune unless you want to play along with the original recording. All right, so let's get down to it. Uh, the E power chord, eight per measure, two measures worth, 16 strokes on that E power chord. Right on, well, she got her daddy's car. So, well, she got her daddy's car and she cruised to the hamburger. Now, right on stand, you're going to drop down to an A power chord. You're going to have a little motion for the next 16 downstrokes. Just a classic bluesy rock and roll shuffle pattern. I have my one finger A power chord, but on the third and seventh strokes of each measure, I let my ring finger come down. I recommend the ring finger, you could use your pinky. Fourth string, fourth fret. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right on a uh, on the word uh, seems she forgot, right on forgot all about, we have back to the E power chord, that's where we head back to. Forgot all about the library, like she told her own. Okay, now here's the only tough part of the tune, and it's not easy at first. You're going to keep your index on the fifth string second fret, but you're going to form a B power chord with the ring finger on the fourth string fourth fret. Now, you're going to do 16 downstrokes. You could just stay right in that formation and do 16 downstrokes. Right on, uh, told her old man, right on old man now. But instead of doing 16 downstrokes on the power chord, you're gonna reach up with your pinky. <laughs> and this is gonna be tricky for, for a lot of you, but with the practice, you'll get it. The pinky is gonna cancel out the ring finger. Pinky six on the fourth string. It's gonna sound like this. Aside from just sheer minutes and minutes and minutes of practice to get this uh, stretch happening, what helps is to have your thumb well down the neck of the guitar. My thumb is not back here. My thumb is right there with uh, the tip of my thumb pointing up towards the ceiling, okay? That's the only way that I personally can get enough of a reach there with my pinky finger. And I definitely could not do this on my first try. Now, if this is problematic, which it's going to be for a lot of you at first, or if you just want to play this tune right now and, uh, and keep working on it in your free practice time, just stick with the B power chord 16 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, nothing wrong with that. And then keep working again that pinky finger up there, fourth string, sixth fret. Okay, and with the radio blasting, right on radio, we're back to the E power chord. Ha, ah, it's a relief, right? E power chord, 16 beats. Radio blasting. Cruising just as fast as she to the A power chord with that motion with that extra note added right on as fast as she can and she'll have now here's where things get interesting what I would call the chorus of the tune the fun 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 part uh, it's all power chords but check out this harmonic motion this is right on fun 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 one two three four there's the E power chord a G sharp power chord. One, two, three, four. Up one fret to the A power chord. One, two, three, four. Up two frets to the B power chord. One, two, three, four. I'll do that again. Really interesting motion there up the neck. And then it starts over again, almost the exact same. 
to wrap up the chorus four strokes on the E power chord. But this time it goes up to the fifth fret to the A power chord first. Then back one to the G sharp. And finally to the B power chord up at seven. And then the whole thing goes back to the E power chord and the next verse begins. Okay, so that chorus is kind of interesting, right? Before the chorus, we were mostly down here, you know, in, in second position, index finger at the second fret for the E power chord and for the A power chord and for the B power chord. But now all of a sudden, you're going to be moving up and down the neck a little bit. Fun. Just power chords. All right, so there you have the heart of the song, Fun, Fun, Fun by the Beach Boys. Uh, for a lot of you, you're going to breeze through it, and the big sticking point is that pinky reaching up there. But let's keep it optional for right now when you do the B power chord, okay? Play through it with a regular B power chord, but then practice a little bit every day. Getting that, that pinky note. All right, everybody, thank you for watching. Don't forget to... Uh, Please give this video a like and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Check out the uh, website you see down there, Songbike. That's my website. And you can see a lot of great videos there. You can become a member for 10 bucks and get access to lots of stuff you can't see on YouTube. All right, there it is, our riff of the day. Remember, tune down a half step if you want to play along with the original recording. Fun, fun, fun from the Beach Boys. And I will see you for another riff of the day tomorrow.